What's going on you guys? My name is Crygo Crystal, or you can call me Crygo, and welcome back for Pokemon Omega Ruby Randomizer Nuzlocke. In the last episode we battled May We battled May Arrival. As you can see, I have done some stuff with the graphics of this game. Just a little bit, to uh, see how it looks. I kinda like running it a little smoother looking. It also helps me for thumbnails because of the fact that I don't have really low quality photos in the end to use. We're gonna... Uh, in between the videos I did grind everyone up to around level early level 20 and I made a few team changes. Um, so we now have Tempest that knows Shockwave and Vibe on our team. That's literally all the team changes. I battled all the trainers in the area, did the Soda Pop event and all that stuff so... There's not much else to do. I know there's an item around here. Hold on. I don't even remember where it is. I I know in uh, Ruby and Sapphire there's two players, two characters that block you there. So that might be what I was thinking of. Tynemo. Does Tynemo have Tynemo has Levitator already, right? If I remember correctly. Oh god. One thing about Wisdom Teeth is you get holes. They leave holes in your mouth. In the end, the craters take like they say it takes a few months to heal. A few weeks to heal, but in reality, it literally will take you a year or two to actually fully heal after it, which is really annoying. So I'm still in the early stages, so I still have like massive gaping holes in my teeth or in the back of my mouth. So it's really annoying when you eat something because it get sometimes they get a lot of times they get caught in the back of your mouth. So it's really, really it's the worst thing in the world. Damage. Oh yeah, we got revenge as well. I had to switch my mouth over, Rose, I'm sorry. I might cut the audio for that. Probably should. Okay. Ganlon Berry. We're gonna... What'd you see? It's right here? Oh, it's right there. You know what, whatever. There it is. Ooh, a revive. Oh, yeah, the uh, hidden names aren't randomized in this game. I got a Razor Claw from someone, so. When we get ourselves a Sneasel or something, we can use it. Throw. What do you get? You get, like, Revenge, Bide, your bulk, you know that. So, let's go Dragon Rage. I want to get Teeps to level 25, because I think that's when he evolves. Holy! Okay, Seismic Toss I'm not worried about. Because Teeps evolves, I think, level 25-ish into Gib Gibble. Not Gibble, oh my god, Gabite. And I would appreciate that, just getting some more moves, having a bit more... stronger stats. Would be super useful. Just because Dragon Rage only does so much up to a certain point, so... Like, it's just around here. I'm curious. Whatever. I love the different de designs they have for the... I don't need another repel. For the ears. Or your dusting machine. So this game, they had ears. Uh, earlier on, they had... What? they uh, on In Diamond and Pearl, which is the worst one, for the dusting machine, it was like a touchscreen thing. Which I know they're trying to use the DS as much, but it didn't really turn out well. Grimothy. Wow, this is Marvel City. Haha. <laughs> oh wait. Uh, you must be really enjoying it, Wally. So what? What do you want to like to do? You want to grab a bite to eat the Marvel food court, or maybe we could get you a bike of your own at Drydell Cycles. Would you like to do that? I bet exercise would be good for your health. No, thank you. I want to challenge the gym right away. What? Let me see. I'm pretty sure the gym is um. Yep, straight ahead, just through the inner courtyard. Hey, wait, Wally. I don't remember the, my Wally voice because I think the last time we actually talked to Wally 
was the beginning of the game, so it's been a hot minute. But one thing I do want to do before finding Wally is sup. Thank you. Give it to me. Yo. Um, I looked it up, and Thunderous Therian is a little slower, but it does um, give us more attacking stats. Higher attacking stats. See, if you look at this now. Let's go. A 71 special attack. It's the lowest level mod on my team. It's got the highest special attack on my team. I, it's expected of a legendary, but like, still, it's crazy. And I also really like Therian. I love Therian form of almost every single one. Like, the god look is super dope, but the... I love the Therian form for all of them. It's like their alternate forms, you know, like, because I know that's the idea. They're supposed to be kind of like the gods, rulers of the skies, gra earth, and thunder, and lightning. So, like, I don't know, man. How many super potions do I got? I can go like four. I got a bunch more uh, healing items as well. So buy five. And one. I like to stay stocked up on my stuff. anti paralysis heal, awakening. I'm not going through another May thing where I'm being put to sleep every turn. So, boom. Boom. Uh, we'll get encounters now or after the Wally stuff. I think I want to do the Wally stuff first. Let's see. Um... Uncle, I'm begging you. I want to challenge the dream to see how much I can stronger I've gotten. Please, you'll let me, won't you? Now hold on, Wally. I'm certain true that you're growing quite a, strong, a lot stronger alongside your Pokemon, but you don't don't you think that jumping it right into a challenge of a gym might be pushing it? I'm not pushing it. If it's me and my Ralts, we can beat anyone. Oh, Crygo. Ralts and I have gotten a lot stronger since we first met growing together. I want to prove to you that my uncle both, Crygo. Please, help me once more and have a battle with me. Thank you, Crygo. Okay, here we go. We're gonna have to win this, or else we have to. Spoilers, you lose. It's Steven. Are you sure? He's a Trevenant. That's annoying. You know what, Trevenant? I'm just gonna... Click one move. He's getting stronger. I don't. Trevenant does neutral damage to me, so I'm not too scared. How much is Dragon Rage doing? Just about half. See, Dragon Rage is now like a viable thing to use normally in battle because it's not gonna one shot everything. Guaranteed. There we go, Dratini. Um. Nothing I have actually deals with dragon types. Let's use Rugged. It's neutral. And you're bulky. This routine is probably gonna know Dragon Rage. Please do a decent amount with Horn Attack. Oh. Oh, we crit. Okay. Bye, Dratini. I would appreciate a little bit of a harder battles. I did decide to switch out Excalibur for vibe because Excalibur is just not really carrying her weight so I decided to swap her out for vibe just because I want a bit more coverage we can flame burst this and it'll die okay we're a little Pompey is a little bit higher level than everyone damn I've tried to not use her use her against um Watson I just had a slight nightmare I looked down at my recording and thought I, and I saw because I use OBS right and it says live and recording. And since I'm not streaming, I looked at live and I'm like, oh, uh, it says zero. I'm, am I, am I, have I not been recording? And then I realized, nope, recording's right next to it. We're all good. Damn, this thing's bulky. Look at this boy. Look how beautiful this boy is. Tempest. Tempest is a god. I love this thing. What are you designed after, though? When do you learn Shockwave, by the way? I said Shockwave, I learned uh, Revenge, not Shockwave. Yikes. 
I don't know how to deal with poison types. Um, I guess I'll just use Teeths. When does Weezing get Explosion? In the background, oh, I was gonna say, in the background I have a video rendering and upload, uploading. Let's just Weezing. I know, I try not to, I try not to look up moves and stuff, but since this thing has a chance of knowing Explosion, we're not chancing anything. Uh, Gen 6. It learns Explosion and Self-Destruct level 23. Oh, we're fine. We're good. I can just Dragon Rage it. Because you don't get it. You have Levitate, so I can't click Santome. I would totally click Santome. But since you don't have Levitate. Since you do have Levitate, sorry. There's a lot of damage, too. Weezing is a pretty strong Mon. Oh my god. I'm sending Pompeii. Fracture is an intimidating Pokemon. I actually want him to have this thing for the rest of the game. It's not Mold Breaker. Yo, it's a speedy boy. Magnitude 6. That should still do a chunk. We're a bit above its level. Dual Chop. I want Dual Chop. I want to move other than Dragon Rage on my Gable. Oh, I was going to turn on my exp experience share for this next little while. But I think we're good because we're above level again. I can't tell the level increases in this game because, like, May was difficult. I mean, I guess we don't need to because I ground up the Pokemon that were lower level on my team. Uncle, I'll go back to Verdant Turf. Crygo, thank you. Being a trainer is tough, isn't it? It's not enough just to battle with your Pokemon. I can't become a true trainer like that. Not really. Wally, there's no need to get down, jump down on yourself. Why? What's keeping you from being stronger? Nothing is all. You need to keep do is keep getting stronger. Come on, let's go home. Everything's waiting for you. Yes, Uncle. Crygo. I am. I'm definitely gonna get stronger, much stronger. I feel like I learned a lot from just one Pokemon battle with you. But my own limits and routes. So, um, that's why, Crygo, if it's alright, I could, could, could I, um, could you, could I call you my, no, oh, never mind, I'm sorry. It was nothing, please forget about it. G goodbye That was a great experience. It just dawned on me that you must be the young man who kept an eye out for Wally when he caught his Pokemon. So it's why you... It's you why we have to thank for Wally becoming a positive future. Wait, I don't know what I just said. Thank you. Uh, here, take this. I want you to have it. It's a bit of thank you. Give me Rock Smash. That was annoying to get in Sun and Moon. Not Sun and Moon. In uh, Ruby Sapphire. Even if there are obstacles in your path, I think you'll be able to break through them. Especially if you use Rock Smash there. We should uh, head back now, but If you ever have time, I'd love it if you could stop by our home at Vernturf. I'm sure Wally would enjoy it too. We'll be looking forward to seeing you. I want to go see if I can get the Gardevoir right. Because I don't know if anyone... Can anyone learn Rock Smash on our team? Oh, a lot of people can learn Rock Smash. I know my Mew can learn it. 100%. What is this? I'm curious. Oh, there's massages. Oh, that's dope. I'll do that for if I have a Pokemon that needs to evolve with happiness. Let's travel. Yes. I have 17 Poke Miles. There's literally- You can buy rare candies here for 500. What are Poke Miles? Is it like Air Miles? That's a Canadian- I think that's a Canadian thing. Anyways, it's time to get a new encounter! Whoa. I'm gonna save the encounter on the other side of Mauville, just because I want to get a Surf encounter there. An Oshawa! I'll take Oshawa. It's not a bad Pokemon. I didn't heal. It's a good chunk. I will use Oshawa possibly in the future because I don't need it right now. I realize I have a lot of ground. Teeps, I love you, man, but you can't be doing that.
I'm gonna go see. Oh, it's another Elite Four battle. Battling Glacia with a Tauros. I really should have healed. This thing is terrifying. No, it's fine. Wait, I got a solution. Oh, you're Intimidate. I would have rather had Intimidate on my Tauros. Tempest can come in on this. Oh, no, it's Pursuit! No! Holy crap. That almost went really bad. I should have known it was Pursuit. But at least I got safe switching now. Oh, dude, you're dead. Ready for this? Revenge. Yo, it did nothing. Okay, it did half, but like... Okay, that's annoying. I didn't realize how, like, fitting this Tauros is for a breeder. Because, like, breeder has... Tauros is like one of the... It's like Tauros and Miltank are the big kind of cow Pokemon. I don't know, and I think it just kind of fits the breeder a little better. There you go. I'm so happy we have Tempest. This thing is dope. Keeps level 23. Heatran. Pompey can come out. <laughs> I'm not messing with the Heatran. I should have actually no. I was gonna say I could use Vibe against it. I really should have used Vibe actually. Vibe doesn't have any water type moves yet. As soon as I get Waterfall, which is like late game, and if Vibe's still around, you know I'm using Waterfall on that thing. Magnitude 8. There you go, Pompey. Doing the damn thing. Goodbye. 1,000. Yeah, that should have been... That should have been given to Vibe. Earth Power? What are my stats? I mean, I'm not going to use Focus Energy, am I? So... Polyrath. Tempest. This is going pretty well. So far, this nu Nuzlocke hasn't been terrible. I've built the momentum I need to keep going. And we haven't lost too many Mons. Yet. Holy crap. I'm assuming the gyms will get harder. I'm, I have too much of a insurgence mindset right now. And what that means is I'm just so used to grinding after videos. That I'm just like, I need to do this to make sure my Pokemon don't die. But in reality, this is a normal Game Freak game. And, which means, it's not gonna be a hard, hard game. By default. Sure, later on in the game, if I don't grind, it will get harder. And I think that's what I'm gonna wanna see. So I don't think I'm gonna grind for a little while. I think I'll be fine for the gym. I'm always, like, questioning whenever we're, like, around an area where they give a lot of trainers because it means they want you to battle all the trainers before you go on to the gym or whatever. And I think that's why, they, that, that's definitely why they put them there. Wow, the Mandibuzz lived. Look at that. Tempest just clicking moves and destroying everything. I need a better electric type move on you, though. I will get Volt Switch for you. Pop it. I'll just stay in. Whatever. This is neutral. Should do a chunk. Yeah! No! Pop it looks like a soulless. It looks like it's devi it, it it will devour a child. I hate Hopip. It's literally the most unneeded Pokemon. Its base stats are kind of bad. That's the thing I always question when they add Pokemon that have really bad base stats just don't end up having any use in competitive. Like why put them in at all? In the end, if they're just not going to do anything, is it just or is that just me? Is that just my thought process? I really hope I can use Rock Smash now so I can get Gardevoir right. I think I'm gonna teach it to Pompey. Actually no, I'll teach it to... I'll teach it to... Rugged. Can we be aware that I'm using a Tauros still and it's late in the game? I don't use... Rage at all. Boom. Let's head to Rock T. I'm probably totally. Let's just test. Yeah, I need the badge first. Not happening. Yeah. 
I kind of laughed that last episode we actually went to the freaking. Oh, I have to battle you again if I come across, don't you? Oh, I don't. Never mind. What the hell is that? Sounds like a clink. I'm curious. I bet you it's a clink or a clink clang or something like that. Mm-hmm. Look at that. I know what I know what Pokemon. It's only because it sounds like It's only because it sounds like it. Yeah, this is the part where we just like, screw that. We're gone. I'm gonna try to get to the next area just to catch the other encounter. And I'm debating battling the trainers between episodes again. Just to battle them. There was like, I was battling trainers between episodes to grind, and there was like two trainers that had me pre megas. And that's the thing I hate about when I try to, when I grind between. I see these things and I'm like, why couldn't I have them in the video? And that's just me not you not like actually taking the time to go and record it in video. And I completely understand why. It's completely my fault. Holy crap. Burps. Okay, please don't give me the venipede, because I don't want a venipede. Give me something interesting. Give me a thumbnail. Give me a thumbnail right now. This is called a thumbnail Pokemon, right here. That isn't even a bad Pokemon, but Teeths cannot stay in on that. Oh, uh, we'll use... Vibe. You get Dragon Rage, never mind. Okay, use Delia. This thing can have Tough Claws, which is crazy. My shot. That did a good chunk. Yikes. Holy, that's a crit. Okay. We're fine. Oh my god. Having this in the back. That's terrifying. It just set up. I'm gonna switch to Pompeii because Pompeii has a bit more bulk. I named these Cookie Cutter. I don't know why. I like. I feel like it's a very fitting name for it. Yeah, I feel like Cookie Cutter fits. I've cut a drug gun on my own when I'm playing on my own in my own personal file with a Pokeball. I can do it again. See, right now, click. <laughs> I'm trying to think. I. So glad we got some new Pokemon. A new Pokemon. Okay, let's name this thing. Comment. Let's go, Cookie Cutter. It's a gender neutral name. I swear, isn't it? Cookie Cutter. We could do the wind slow, wind straight helps, if we want. I might do a bit of trainer stuff next episode. I'm trying to think, because I want to try to. Because if we do another gym battle, it'll be like we'll be just sl shooting out gym battle. That's kind of normal with this gen, isn't it? Let's do the wind straight house today. I'm a heal, and we'll do the wind straight house. I want to get Gibble to evolve this episode, which might be an extra ten minute video. But like, who cares, man? Be fun. I'm enjoying playing this game a little too much. I always want to play it, which means I always want to record this, which is awesome. It's a good feeling. I want you to know I have been terrified to record and upload Insurgents at the time of recording this because the, I'm retrying the Elite Four battle because the Nuzlocke doesn't uh, fail unless you have nothing in your party. And since I don't have, since I had a, um, I mean, PC, since I had Pokemon on my PC, I had to, I'm like, yeah, I'll go back and try it again. But now it's like a thing of, I failed the first time, I'm kind of terrified to do it again. 
Yeah, no, yeah, mask. Yeah, no mask. I just want to get Teeps to level up, man. Level 25 and I'll be fine. It's a hex, man. Oh yeah, they don't heal you between, do they? Yikes. I think he... Doesn't Gibble get dual chop by level up? After it evolves? Or as an evolution move? This is a ton... Vibe doesn't have any water type moves! I need to get some water type moves on Vibe. Oh, that is a... Whole Charizard. I don't know who to switch in for this. You know, this is Rugged's time, maybe? How much is a number doing? That's a lot of damage. I found my thumbnail! Holy. High quality thumbnails are right here. Holy crap, man. Don't kill, don't kill, don't kill. We're good, we're good. We're good. Wow. He said Charizard. I was like, okay, it's not going to be too bad. And then I'm like, oh yeah, pre-megas are a thing in this game. I have to look. I have to try to get it. Of course it carries Dragon Rage. And we're not faster either. Let's carry heal 60. We're fine. Don't, just don't click Dragon Rage again. Please. Okay, we're good. Yeah, we live. And then the special effects of the sun, boosting your fire type moves. Oh my god. This is not a fun time, man. Don't worry, Rugged's like, no! I'm not dying today! It's not happening! Which is awesome. My boy. My boy. Vibe is level 24. Learn a water type move. Okay. It's time. Timpole. What do you learn? By level up. You learn Muddy Water level 27. That's the next water type move you learn. Okay. And you evolve at what level, sorry? 25. So when does Palpato learn the next water type move? Muddy Water, level 28. Okay. So in other words, I have to level this thing out. It learns, it has Meteor Mash because the Pikachu defaults to having Meteor Mash when it's given to you because of the fact of the whole Pikachu event. They've got a family of water types. Oh, speak of, speaking of uh, that evolution line, I could use a Grass type. Please tell me I, I'm not I'm not healed. It does shouldn't have too many crazy strong moves. That does a lot of damage. And that doesn't do enough damage. We are immune to mudshot. I'm gonna switch in Tempest. Cause I'm pretty sure Thunderous is a flying electric to oh. Okay, it's okay. It's okay. Bite. If I can flinch it, we're fine. Yes. Revenge. Oh my god. I was really hoping you'd go for up or again so I could get the boost on the revenge. Damn! This thing is bulky. I need a grass type. There's both. How come I don't have that move, man? That does way too much damage. <laughs> I mean, Thunderous has never actually had been the bulkiest of all the ones. I think, is Thunderous not the most offensive? That may, might be Landorus, though. Oh, you only have one mod. Yo, we're getting money out of this, too. There's two more, I think. I think. Isn't this supposed to be Steven's family? No, Steven Stone. I don't know who the Winstreet's family is. Oh my god, they're bringing out all the mons I cannot deal with right now. That's an ice type. 
my team is like punched with the ice type. Unless you're vibe. Yo, we're close. Gibble's close to leveling up and get. Uh, no, I need to level in a bit. And I'm fine. We're fine. We live this. Look at that. Delicious. Incoming meteor mash right now. Look at this. I kind of want to keep it on Timbull just so it, I can use it whenever. If you freeze me right now, man. Look at how much damage that meteor mash did, though. It's dope. Boom. And there's the attack boost. We'll just mudshot you now. I should kill. Oh, wait. I just realized Temple's supposed to evolving here. It's gonna evolve here. I have to get a freaking note paper now. It's gonna evolve. Damn it. Layout stuff. I actually already did layout out of this episode. It's fine. Natu. Well, Bob's gonna evolve, so I'm gonna switch in. What's your boy's name? Teefs. I'm gonna heal because I don't trust anything in this game right now. We're not even. When you get to level 40, it's high powered attacks, which is gonna be. Not okay. No, that's what I assumed you had, but I didn't wanna chance anything. Lucky chant? Bro, there's no crits from Dragon Rage. Yo, that did way too much damage. Awesome. Lit! Goodbye, Natu. Natu is gone. Chansey? Yo, Teeth's gotta fight this. We do 40 damage 100%. That's a lot of experience. It's like... Is Tackle gonna do more? You know what we gotta do? We gotta Sand Tome and get residual damage at the same time. Should do a chunk because Chansey's not good at physical attacks. Chansey's a great Pokemon for uh, draft leagues and stuff. It's crazy good. I love Dra I love Chansey. I don't run it all the time just because it's super overused sometimes. If it gets knocked off, you're just kind of screwed because it needs to carry Eviolite or else it's going to get bodied. Okay, so level 25, you learn Slash. Oh, uh, get rid of Tackle for that. Yo, can there be a Mega Chansey, please? I think we just get two evolutions here, right? Yes! This is the boy. I had to write down, just so I could remember the layout in it. We have a Gibble now. Or Gabite, sorry. Jeez! I know this Evolution 9. Dual chop, dual chop, dual chop. And now we have Vibe Evolving. I'm down. Vibe Evo at 33. Is say 33, 45. A Palpitoad, I'm down. Give me a better move. Nah. We got two good mons now. Oh, this girl's gonna cry to a grandmother? Jeez. Did everyone in their team end up having a important trainer class? I'll have to look back at the recording. Okay. Okay, Grandma. Listen. Look at Teefs now. Look at the boy! What do you do to me? Hyper- Yeah, no. That's not okay. That... No. <laughs> no, I don't like that. How much is that doing? About half my health. So we're gonna switch into... Pompeii. The big red button. This is not Super Fang. That'd be a little, that'd be exactly half my health. Okay, you need to stop clicking that move. It's doing way too much damage. Take a lava plume. If your guts and this burns, I'm gonna be mad. Or just kill, please. 
Why is this Eradicate giving me so much problems? Actually, no, Eradicate's la later game do get annoying because of the fact that they get, like, Hyper Fang and Super Fang by level up. I can't confidently stay in and click another move without being concerned that I'm going to lose a, a Mon. And especially our big red button, so... I'm not going to let it go. Why is this move so busted? I mean, I guess they... I greased my chair before we recorded. Why is it squeaking again? You know what? I'm just gonna... There, it's locked. Can't move that. It's just louder now. Whatever, man! This is the end of the Winstreet's house, anyways. We got a lot done. We got a decent amount done. Whoa, so strong. My granddaughter was alive. Oh, Archie has a granddaughter. Confirmed. There we go. We're done. And I think this is a pretty good spot to wrap up the video. We got through the Wind Straits house today. That was, that was fun. A nice little tidbit to end the video on. If you guys did enjoy, make sure you click the like button down below. And don't be afraid to subscribe to the Crystal Crew. It always helps support the channel and the series a lot. In the next video, we should be facing off against Watson, the electric-type gym leader, but not so electric-typing in this game. And we will be getting our third badge and pro possibly moving on to get another encounter. Anyways, guys, I will see you in the next video. See you then, guys.